it's Gloria Hyatt MBE. And some people know me as Coach Gloria, um, and some people just simply know me as Gloria Hyatt. Um, depending on how you've worked with me uh, in the past. But what I want to do is share with you, because I've had so many conversations with people about uh, how to succeed online, what it is you need to do, um, what things you should be looking for. And whilst people are really curious and you've got different reasons for getting online, it might be that you've uh, you know just finished a job and you're wanting to earn some extra money online and uh, it might be that you know you've got a passion a niche that you want to share you know there's something that you're really passionate about maybe it's your cooking i've just spoke to a chef earlier on today and you know he wants to share his foods his menus you know um online with people so other people can enjoy his passion and also um, buy and pay for um, the, the products that he has. There's so many reasons why people want to get online, you know, and if I start with my own personal journey, I got online, you know, because I am a certified coach and I wanted to be able to share more of my products with more people and um, just be able to show them, you know, wants, a lot of people want, uh, because those of you who know me already you know that I'm a head teacher, you know, I've led a school for 16 years and um, I really thought it was important to be able to motivate and uplift people and for them to be able to get um, products that are available to them that they could do home study courses like I am here working from my home office and um, that's why I first started looking, you know, and I, I meddled with a few bits of information and I bought books. And then I eventually found an online home business. And the home business, um, you know, was quite attractive to me because it was about empowering people, which is something, you know, I'm really passionate about, empowering people, uplifting people. Um, and what I seen there was an opportunity to get with a group of people who were very similar to me, who, um, you know, were sharing the same ideals and passions. But the other thing that I thought was really good, you know, after looking into the products, you know, and I've got to admit, I've got a confession here, you know, I actually got attracted because somebody said blog for profits, blog for profits. And, you know, it so turns out that it's really quite difficult to blog for profits. It's not impossible. And, um, you know, the blog, although it's a fantastic blog and, you know, I put my coaching information up there, as well as the online products that I, you know, that I use um, to help you learn about um, online, you know, what's a lead, what to do with a lead. You know, some people don't even know what a lead is. A lead is a prospect, it's a name of a person, a real person, and a phone number. And, you know... It's not enough just to get them. I thought it was just enough to get, you know, a lead and, uh, you know, they suddenly run into my sites and buy uh, the information that I have to sell. But there's so much more to it uh, than that. What I came to understand is that, you know, it's like the offline world where I used to go and meet people and I used to, um, you know, have a conversation with them. And some people were a bit like me, you know, and this is a leader's trait to just see the information, take the time, write down the high points, write down the lowish points, you know, and make a decision, get my card out and, you know, buy the product and get started and get going. Um, and other people, you know, would spend a lot of time, you know, mulling over the information and then just following you, yeah, just being on the different social network sites. So that you could, um, you know, get them to know you and for them to decide if they like you. Because, you know, sometimes people don't like you. And it's not because you're not likable. It's just because they, you, your personality doesn't suit their personality. And that's basically what I've learned whilst being online. That, you know, there is a skill set. The skill set and the traits are very common to anything that you need to be successful in. You know, if I say today, you know, I, I told um, a, a big grown person, look, if you can't afford to call someone back on your phone, 
that's usually a good indication that maybe you're not ready to start a business because one of the key components of having a business is having a phone. You know, um, whether it's to call people back or to look online at your Facebook or at your emails, you know, because most of businesses can be conducted on your phone. Though ideally, you know, at some point, you know, you're going to use your tablet like I am today or you're going to use, um, you know, your desktop um, because, uh, you know, it's storage and it's been able to see it on a bigger screen because, you know, little screens have their limitations. So they're the kind of things, you know, and I'm talking really basically and, you know, I, I, so I even had a person say to me, I'm really interested in getting online but I'm not on the internet. But I thought, that's really interesting, isn't it? You know, because it's like saying I really want to drive a car. I really want to drive a car, and I want that car over there, but it's got no wheels. Because if you haven't got the internet, your car ain't got no wheels, and it ain't going to go. So, you know, to me, if you are really serious about something, you know, that you want to do online, there's so many things that you can do. You can buy products. You can be an affiliate. And you might say, well, what's an affiliate? An affiliate is really a great position for people who haven't, like me, created their own products, their own products to sell what people buy um, and use all the time, um, or just don't have the desire to do that. So, you know, I'm an affiliate as well as having my own products on my uh, coaching sites. And those affiliate, um, by being an affiliate, I can sell the products. And, you know, what attracted me to my uh, company that I'm presently with is because I can sell them products at a hundred percent profit. Now, who's going to argue with that? A hundred percent profit. You know, in most businesses, it's usually only really the food industry where you can actually, you know, sell products and get that kind of turnaround. So, you know, to be able to be in a business which allows you to sell your products at a hundred percent, minus a little bit of uh, money off for bank exchange, you know, which you can't really complain about, you're in. A really good business. The other thing which I thought was really, really attractive, you know, and I think, you know, this is a great thing to do, is that you can um, sell products that are the low end, you know, because there's got, always going to be some people who want to come into business, and I find it really funny to buy a blog for thirteen pounds or twenty five dollars if you're in the US, you know, or whatever your conversion is. Because there's people all around the world that, you know, I have contact with and, and communicate with about these things. But, you know, realistically, and I say to people, well, if you're really, really interested in getting into a business like this, you do need to go in and get all the products as much as you can afford, you know. And, you know, this can involve a couple of thousand pounds um, to get all of the products. But you've got all of the education, but more importantly, you can sell those products with 100% commission. Imagine if you got in and you didn't have all your products and therefore somebody else like me who brought you in gets the commission. How bad would you feel then? So, you know, ultimately it's about an all-in commitment. You know, um, I say to people, look, you know, if you go buy a, a pair of training shoes from the shop, you don't say, well, I'm only going to buy one of the training shoes because they're not really committed to having them training shoes. You know, when you decide you're going to go and buy, you know, your dinner from, um, you know, your local food store, you know, whether it be a chip shop, you know, whether it be a takeaway, you don't say, excuse me, can you just give me half? You know, because I'm not really interested in having my dinner. Of course, you're going to buy all of the things and this is this is what you've really got to get to understand if you're going to be online and you're online marketing that you know you really do make that commitment make that time and make that energy but people really need to understand what it is to get involved and not in to totality the reason I say that is look when I got into this business you know uh, my business opportunity that I'm involved in now I didn't know everything about it and the reason I didn't need to know everything about it is this, is when I set up a school 
the first school that was a business in the United Kingdom. I didn't know everything about it. I had a business plan. But I didn't know that, you know, you needed this amount of money or, you know, I'm going to um, have to make these changes in year two. And in year three, I'm going to have to call a board together who can have to guide me, you know, and use their expertise um, and have a greater uh, number of um, employees in the school um, than I first anticipated that it was going to grow rapidly at the race, you know. But 40,000 um, was uh, or the income that I was generating uh, when I first started out. By the time in which I left the school, you know, and this school, like I said, was set up as a business, the first in the United Kingdom, I got um, a member of the British Empire Award which um, is for services to education and shows me to be a leader in my own right, at least in the field of education. Um, what I didn't realise is that, wow, you know, um, we're going to be turning over um, one and a half million pounds, um, which in um, US dollars is round about um, nearly, you know, um, a million, uh, one and a half million there, about a little over. Uh, dollars, a lot of money, you know, but this is the beauty of life that, you know, whilst there is some certainty, nothing is definite, but what you do is you have to have your plan, you have to have your goals, you have to have your ambition, you know, it's your ambition that actually motivates you, um, and that's what you need to do, but sometimes you need somebody who is going to be there to support you. Now, you know, that didn't always happen for me. Um, I think, given the type of person I am, you know, I'm very assertive, um, very much somebody who finds out the information, is very committed, you know, you can rely on me. Um, I, 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 I am communicative, and I do, um, you know, read research and do the learning, and I, I tend to, you know, follow my own path, you know, and that's not to say I don't, take up and be led. Of course I do, you know, I've, I've been led by some fantastic people, but when I first came into this, I have to say that, you know, um, my peer, my leader, you know, didn't lead me, and um, so I had to go around and search for other leaders, and it cost me some money, you know, and some time, and some failure, uh, you know, to, to go through and find the right one, because, you know, People are out there saying the leaders and actually showing me a fantastic result. But, you know, I had this debate um, with other leaders and said that, you know, the first thing about leadership is people need to be able to teach, to learn themselves, to teach and to apply it. And not everyone can do that. You know, some people can do the, the learn and the apply bit, but you can't do the middle bit. You don't know how to teach it to somebody. You don't know how to coach it to somebody. You know, and I've seen loads of examples of that online. So many people, you know, who actually can't teach and can't coach, but they're fantastic at doing it for themselves. You know, and they're fantastic of uh, 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 achieving the kind of results that you want. And so what you have to do is be really savvy online and take notice of the person, you know, how they talk, who they communicate with, what their results are, what they post, you know, watch their videos, you know, um, and, you know, watch out for things, you know, they say, oh, you know, I'm living a great life, and then you look at their home, you know, or their car, or, um, you know, the way they're dressed, and you think, well, I'm sorry, but that is not what I see. Um, and that's not to say that, you know, you've got to wear, you know, a suit. It's not to say that you've got to wear, you know, um, the you know, the the T-shirt and that makes you less than, absolutely not. But there are certain things that you can pick up, how the person speaks, you know, how, um, you know, they communicate, um, what their results are, if you can get to see that. Because sometimes, you know, I know a lot of people who are actually quite um, bashful about saying, hey, I've earned six-figure income. I'm not bashful about saying I've earned a six-figure income. No more am I bashful about saying, and I have failed massively to the point where some people think, oh, I shouldn't know what she's doing. 
you know, um, there's been times when I don't know what I'm doing, and I've had to go out and find and search for that information, you know, and pull together the right um, coaches to help me along the way, um, and sometimes just say, no, I don't want you as my coach, or I can't learn from you, or I don't like the way you um, communicate, you know, um, but, you know, how you do it is really quite important. Um, but the best advice I give for people is, look, be clear about where you are. Don't lie, don't exaggerate, because you're only cheating yourself, really. You know, if you haven't got a lot of money, there are three ways of getting in. You know, um, and what I say to people is, look, get in for free. You know, I have a product at the moment, which is iPass, and it actually will lead you into my business opportunity. Now, iPass will allow you to spend 30 days, 30 days, being able to look around, to learn about marketing, um, you know, to get your money together, to see the reason why you would want to spend your money to make money, because I always say to people, look, well, you know what, free is great, but you do have to spend money to make money at some point. Some people are like you believe, I mean, on that I see all kinds of people posting their results and they've got to tell you they've spent a thousand pounds on leads. <laughs> um, of course, you've done a fantastic thing by converting them, converting them. But, you know, um, there's, there's so much more behind the stories and the faces and the information that people give you. And it's not something like I could tell you right here and right now. Um, but what I would say to you is, you know, if you're a really serious business person, you know, as I am, if you're somebody who, you know, really wants to make a success to help others, you know, and to to to, to be able to have less of a, a challenge than I had, um, to have a system that, you know, is workable, then I invite you to, you know, engage with me, get on my list, contact me through Facebook or social medias, Glory Highest MBE or Coach Glory, and either way you'll find me. And, um, you know, start the conversation, look at the products. You know, products are pretty self-explanatory. What I always say to people is, look, you know, I prefer you to just go there and get your information, get your products, make a decision. And once you've done that, you know, I am available to uh, coach, train, and teach you because that is my expertise. That's what I've got my certification for, and that's what I apply. Um, to uh, the things that I do get involved in. The second thing I'd, I'd, I'd expect you and understand that you would do is, you know, spend a lot of time learning. Be prepared to learn. Be prepared to read books. Switch off the telly. Be prepared to, you know, listen to audios um, from other people who've had different levels of success. Because some people are really great um, in you know, video marketing, some people are really great in email marketing, some people are really great on Facebook, you know, some people are really great on doing the conversions and the sales, you know, and that's that definitely is one of the things that people really fall down on. And I think it's a combination of things because I know when I, um, you know, was leading my school and one of the things, you know, I, I had a staff of about 50 and I say about because sometimes the numbers, you know, um, went down, sometimes the numbers went up, depending on how much income and what programs I was running, etc., etc. And, you know, when a member of the staff come to you and say, I don't worry about my income because I know you, Gloria, are passionate and determined to bring that money in. I have every confidence in you. And for some people, that's kind of enough to crush them. But for me, because I was passionate, I was passionate about creating the change that my school created. My school created the change in um, how many people were in employment for the first time, how many people went to a place of education and succeeded for the first time, or set up their own little businesses for the first time and became entrepreneurial, like I was an entrepreneurial head teacher. So, you know. It's different personalities and different things that people have that will, you know, um, encourage you to get online. But what I would say is there isn't a cheat sheet and there isn't a quick way and there isn't a cheap way. Really, there isn't a cheap way. You know, there's very few people who make money 
with a few pence. You know, there's very few people who, um, you know, um, don't commit that make that make money. There's very few people that don't follow leaders and don't listen and learn from leaders that make money. These are the things that you know you need to not make the mistake of doing. Not make the mistake of following the wrong leader. Don't mistake that you can do this cheap and easy. Don't mistake that you know there's a big pot of gold at the end of the rainbow that just popped up just for you. What I would say to you is, you know, have a look, take the time to make it fit for you. So if you're working, you know, I know loads of people that are online, and because I know them, I've got to know them. You know, I know that and they'll say I'm having the freedom lifestyle, but they're not actually, they're working a full-time job. Um, but, you know, I understand that not everyone wants to say, well, hey, you know, live in a really bad home and, you know, um, I, I, I can't afford to, you know, um, pay my electricity or I can't afford to, you know, phone people on my phone or, you know, um, I've, I've just gone bankrupt and I've got to start all over again. I'm going to have to work another job whilst I'm trying to uh, get this up, you know, and whilst I am going to succeed. So, you know, there's all types of situations and all types of people and all types of personality. But what I would say is, like I say to people, my time is valuable, your time is valuable. So, you know, I'm really the type of person that says to you, you know, get committed if you want to be with me. Get yourself, you know, aligned with what your um, what your goal and what your ambition is. Not what I want. You know, I'll tell you what to do because, you know, I will tell you. I'll tell you to, you know, like this, follow this, read this, do this, um, you know, so that you can achieve these things. Um, I won't, um, you know, just run after you know the shiny objects and um, why because as i need to run after the shiny objects you know achieve what i've achieved in my life and pretty established you know um for there's a burning a hunger for um more um, and to achieve more and to push myself more um so that other people can benefit from those efforts by their efforts that they put in because of what i've done so you know that's basically what I'm about. That's basically what I would cue you into look at. You know, um, when you're looking online, to remember that actually, you know, fear will stop you. Procrastination will make you never, never get going because you'll always be looking. In fact, some people are on two and three and four and five and six different things. What I'll say is focus. Focus on one, two, or three different things. You know, and maybe three things, because one thing I will say to you, and, you know, a lot of people, especially in the home business, say, oh, just concentrate on that. Just... No, because you have to create multiple streams of income. And what I mean by that is, you know, if, if, you're, like, if you're like me, you've got a coaching practice. I sell products online. I've got a home-based business where I sell marketing products online, you know, and um, I can also coach people, you know, um, one to one. So there's three ways in which I can generate income, and you know, it act, they actually all align with each other, and it's not too complicated to keep them, um, you know, um, working. Um, and I don't have to work on all of them at the same time, you know. As I'm, as we speak, I'm actually working with a very, very successful, extraordinarily successful um, online marketer um, based. Um, uh, well, he's actually Welsh. Um, I always keep saying he's from the UK because I'm so used to hearing the American accents. And um, you know, I'm building that practice now and doing things that I need to do to, um, you know, earn the level of income that I want to uh, improve and, ins and aspire to, um, improve myself, sorry, and uh, aspire to. So, you know, it's a continual process, it's a continual journey, and, you know, you'll have ups and downs, will be, um, what I say is peaks and troughs, peaks and troughs, people. 
you know, some people won't believe in you and they'll, they won't even answer you, you know, and that's not because it's, it's, it's not because, you know, people don't like you, it's because people are so indulged in their own things that sometimes they've forgotten all about you and the commitment that they might have made to you to get back to you, to answer you, to join you, to partner with you or to work with you in some way on some something that you're particularly doing. And so what I'd say to you is, you know, once you join partner with me, I will certainly spend the time to enable you to get to your next step. I'll help you get clear. I'll help you lay out a plan. And uh, you will be able to, 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 to move forward if you take the action. But remember, there are three key things. You've got to know what you want and why you want to do it. You've got to be able to have some income to get started now. And then you've just got to get started. One, two, three. One, two, three. So thanks so much for listening. Um, it's a pleasure to share this information with you. This time next week, I uh, at, the, at the usual time of 7 p.m. UK time, or 2 p.m. Eastern time, or 11 Pacific Standard time, um, I'll be back with uh, some of my business colleagues and uh, share with you some more nuggets of information that will hopefully help you and give you some value for your online journey. Nice to speak to you. Take care and speak to you soon.